Ahoy my hatchlings and welcome to another episode of AutoCraft and today we are starting on my ship because we are going to go ahead and finally build up a storage system which I am super duper excited for but unfortunately this is our last rocket that's that's all we have my rocket chest is completely empty so first things first we are going to go ahead and head on over to our industrial area in order to make some more rockets so it turns out i was wrong i thought i only had one rocket left i apparently had another stack here that i didn't know about that's fine we need to fill this up anyway with a whole set of new rockets oh oh no okay my internet is alive again so <laughs> let's let's try and fill this choker box up before it crashes once more and there we go two full choker boxes of, uh, of rockets that way i have some extra so i don't have to come do this again so soon <laughs> okay so i've been playing around a bunch in both this world as well as one of my testing worlds and basically we're going to have four of these sections with nine each and th there'll be two sections high so we can store 18 in each of these sections which should let us store 18 times 9 is 162 and really we'll have two of the last sections be for overflow so that way we can hold a lot of various items so we'll probably be sorting around 120 items or so but I need to gather a lot of materials for this. Fortunately, not nearly as many as, as like Death had to gather for his thing recently, which I think it was like 800 hoppers. We only need 360. So that's, that's a lot better. That's a lot, lot better. Let's go ahead, gather all the materials we will need for this, and we will meet back up here. Actually, no, let's just jump into high speed build mode. Let's go. I know I said we were gonna go into high speed build mode, but I went ahead and gathered the materials. I realized, I need to, like, actually run this thing and make sure it works before I cover over it, and it will be a lot harder to access. So, let's flick this on, which should put it into the active position. We'll toss in these blocks of quartz. Oh. Um, okay, what's... Oh, I never... Never put in a hopper minecart. There. Okay. Let's quickly put these hopper minecarts in place and okay. I did not make this thing easy to get around in. Okay, so you go up to there and you go up there. Now let's try this again. This goes in here. Blocks of quartz. They're getting eaten. Perfect. Uh, the minecart goes. Furnaces light up. Why hasn't this furnace lit up yet? This. Uh. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna need to rearrange this. This line here. That should be easy enough to do. Because it is getting a little bit stuck. But what we do see is all the stuff is getting poured out like it's supposed to. Out the top. Uh. Now, where did it go? Um. Well, this will be less of a problem when we put it in the floor, at least, but I don't know where where that quartz went. Down here? Where? Oh, yep. Okay, here it is. It's all down here. So let's try this again. Toss in two more blocks of quartz. And I'm just gonna stand along here. Oh, this is off by one. I, I thought this... I tried to make this centered. I apparently did not center it. I'm gonna slide that over by one. Oh! Okay, oh, that, that'll be fixed soon enough. And then... Oh, this is so much fun! Well, now that we know this is working, let's hit higher speed build mode. This time, for real.
end end of Hyper Speed Build Mode and take a look at this storage system. Look at all these curves we have. This I, I love how this thing turned out. I think it looks really fantastic. Uh, I, I really love how this turned out. It's absolutely... Just, oh, I'm so happy. Sorry. Uh, but in here, we've hooked it up that our super smelter will come out of here. And we now have a little light here, which will tell us if the farm is full or the super smelter is full and ready to go. In this case, on means that yes, it is full. But we're not quite done with this system yet. We have the roof, or we have the room done, but we haven't actually hooked up the water streams yet. We've done this side, but I haven't done this other side yet uh, for dropping the water down. And I still need to bring it across from over here all the way over to here. And we need to build this contraption, which I made a schematic of in my testing world. So that way we can sort everything out, basically split out all of the items. Uh, and that way we can just dump everything right into chests and we don't have to take everything out of shulker boxes. So I suppose we could take everything out of shulker boxes. It probably wouldn't be that bad. But th this, this, is, this is more fun and it's more... Uh, more useful for us long term so let's go ahead we'll cut back in once i have finished these two pieces well my hatchlings i do believe it is done and and it's it's really quite late today it's really quite late today but i really wanted to get this thing out for for friday so uh it's it's like 10 p.m thursday but we did manage to get all this stuff all hooked up and unfortunately we the only thing we have left to do after this uh, is to go ahead and sort all the items in here, but we'll worry about that next episode. But we finally have all the water streams hooked up, and we have our little sorting system here, so it will sort into a stream for shulkers, as well as a, another stream for all of the items. And I think this should be absolutely brilliant. But with that, my hatchlings... I've been splashes. The back end of this ship is looking fantastic, and I am so thrilled about how this is going. Unfortunately, we are really, really out of time. So with that, thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day.